Thank you for legalizing marijuana. Pot smokers are rejoicing today after more than two thirds of Jersey voted to legalize recreational marijuana for adults 21 and over. It's going to be an economic driver, a revenue driver, and more importantly, a jobs driver. So I, I, um, I have to say that that is a big step for the state of New Jersey. OK, so nobody should come up behind me and tap me on my shoulder and say, well, they could say recreational marijuana is illegal because technically it still is. Attorney General Gerber Graywell released a statement reminding residents that all of the state's criminal laws relating to marijuana continue to apply until, among other things, the legislature enacts a law creating that regulatory framework. It is important that residents accurately understand the current situation so they don't inadvertently engage in criminal conduct relating to marijuana. Recommendation to the legislature when they were discussing this is that this probably wasn't the opportune time to be able to uh, move forward on something like this. And, and I go back to the issue of impairment, not having the tools in the tool belt to be able to enforce impairment is a big impediment for, for law enforcement. But it is also obviously an issue of safety that we were about for our, our public as well. Dispensary CEO Shia Broadchandel says the process could take months, if not a year, before weed is actually available. You know, it won't happen overnight. And I, I don't think it's going to happen at all in 2020. 2021 um, is, is very likely we'll have the supply available on the market. The sooner we can bring the supply to the market, the sooner we'll all benefit from access. Uh, there's also such a social justice component to this, you know, we need to pass the bills. We need to get people who are being arrested right now for um, these minor offenses to just, uh, you know, not have these issues, expungements, et cetera. Making minority opportunities and business opportunities in the marijuana industry, most important, are going to be large dispensaries like we see medicinally. They're going to be small ones like boutiques. We have an opportunity to, to, to really uh, to make a difference to a community that's been highly impacted from the failed war on drugs. Law enforcement spends right now on investigating and, and, and uh, arresting marijuana criminals. Um, you know, this could also be a potential uh, source of funding in the sense that it will free up revenues that could be deployed in ways that may be viewed as more beneficial for, for society in New Jersey. The amendment, which does not legalize unregulated marijuana, takes effect on January 1st, 2021. For NJ Spotlight News, I'm Raven Santana.